y olvidar mundo. Hola, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo estáis? Hostia, esto está lleno de cosas. Vale. Asegurarme una cosa, todo en orden, perfecto. Two counts, sir. I'm a humble brother, a penitent monk, not a priest, and you're a magnificent bit of work. You may have made some some poor choices, but which of us hasn't? <laughs> you have no idea. But you do, and God does, and that's enough for me and for him. We shall see. That we shall, sir. But why don't you hedge your bets and give two bits to the poor? There are so many who will go hungry tonight. Sure. Bless you, sir. How you getting on, anyhow? These are a somewhat apathetic lot, I'm afraid. Mm. My, um, my mentor says that America is designed to induce apathy in people. It's a wonderful insight. He must be a wise man, your mentor. <laughs> well, sometimes he's a downright fool, but you know, usually he's the best man I know. That's wonderful. The, the thing is, I'm, well, Poverty will always be with us. But slavery, I, I thought we had banished that. But San Denis is acting as a staging post. They're shipping slaves out to some of the islands. I don't believe you. It's 1899. Maybe you should take a look for yourself. I've heard that the pawnbroker down the block around the corner, the one with the green door, well, they say he sells more than forlorn trinkets. Help the poor. Joseph, maybe I'm. Vamos a ver. Mire por dónde va. Okay, bye now. Hey, what can I do for you? Good morning to you. Did you see me? Hey, come on now. Sin sang, so sad. Please be careful. Hi there, Mister. Uh, feel free to browse. Shall do. A bit of a strange question, but you heard tell of slavers around here, buddy? What? Oh, uh, nothing much back there. I, I'm afraid they're just a, a few old books. Uh... Something don't seem right. What's back here? Back there. Looks like this pulls out or something. 
pulls out? No, it's just an old bookcase. Uh, seen better days. How about you open that door? Door? What door? The hidden door. Or I'll open the hidden door in your chest. They made me do it. I, I was always good to them, but they, they forced me to do it, sir. I, I swear. Open the door, now! Oh, okay, okay, just pull the big red book on the bookshelf. It's called The Scourge of Crossbreeding by Harold McDougall. They made me do it, I swear. ¿Quién eres? Please, I'm on your side. It's gonna be okay. Gracias, señor. Muchas gracias. Come with me. Don't worry. You're gonna be all right now. I promise. That's it. Come on. You'll be safe soon. This way. Not much farther. Poor bastards. How are you doing? Who's this man? I don't know. We're free, and that's what matters. We have to trust in him. Exactly. Tampoco os queda otra, también te voy a decir. friend Arthur Arthur Morgan come on you were right found these two imprisoned in that shop oh my that's well they are blessed to have met you Arthur trust me in that they're very unusual I don't think they speak much English my brothers come let's go get something to eat manger comida please hey he forgot this oh yes thank you I uh here payment for your services. I could not have freed these men myself. Give it to the poor old brother. Thank you. I will. Like I said, magnificent. Come on. Come, come, come. Come see me again sometime. I often work at the old church on Gasper Street in St. Francis. Que si. Que el auto guardado va ahí. No te preocupes. a glass. Oh, better be good then. Mm. It's the best. Thank you. Santé. <clears throat> ah, it's quite a country you're building here, eh? For me personally? Mm. I don't know. 
What do you do? Mostly, I just shoot people. Oh, how very American of you. I love it. What do you do? Oh, mostly I, I pose, I show off, I complain. Oh, how very French. I know. <laughs> I am ridiculous. <laughs> I have been all over the world. I have seen the sights, and I have discovered the one eternal truth that I am a pies, um, how do you say, all ass. Hmm? Asshole? Mm, that too. That too. <laughs> mm. Well, at least you have some self-knowledge. <laughs> Where were you on your journey? All the civilized world, painting my little pictures, meeting the locals, you know. You a painter? No, I'm a whole ass. I thought we had covered this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you paint. Not according to salons at Paris, no. According to them, I cannot draw, I cannot paint, and I should go away. And so I went away. You miss Paris? Hmm, that smelly, filthy place with old buildings and ghosts and shit and French people. I have that right here. Hmm? I guess so. Hmm. You know, uh... Arthur. Charles, you know Arthur? Don't believe in art. Hmm. It's lies. Believe in women. They're the truth. Art is lies, but the vagina, that is truth. Breasts is truth. Art. For idiots. If you say so. Oh, trust me, I've tried both. One is better, much better. <sighs> so, I uh, must be boring you. Uh, but, here. What is it? Uh, it's just a little doodle. Uh, you know, entirely worthless, unless you want to wipe your bottom with it. But I wanted to say thank you for the drinks. Well, that's very kind, Charles. Mm, no matter. Good meeting you. Mm. Okay. Hey, El, mi caballo se tiene que estar volviendo loquísimo, también te voy a decir, ¿sabes? Ah, que intente venir. of yourselves I love you and want to make you happy um hello mister hello friend do you want to be rich sure I'll take one that'll be fifty dollars fifty dollars for a book and cheap at the price you read this and you'll want to give me a hundred more Yeah, puta coña. Forget about it. Huh. Well, you're lost, buddy. Come here. Anda la mierda. Come here and buy my book. My book will change your life. My book will make you who you want to be. Who you want to be. What's the matter? You're walking away from history, you fools! Women and men both deserve to decide the future. This is meant to be the no land of liberty? No misma. I am not free to vote? Who says that? Look me in the eye and tell me I am not the equal of any man you ever met. Hello, man. You, my friend, what do you think about women's suffrage? Women voting? Sure, why not? Oh, thank you, sir. You are a true progressive. Anyone dumb enough to want to vote, I say go for it. Oh, a cynic. How dull for you. I do hope you grow out of it, young man. It's so unappealing. 
Unappealing is what I do best. <sighs> you think you're more intelligent than us? Because you keep us in gilded cages? Espérate que aquí hay un... Son extraños y locos. Oh, sí. Excuse me, sir. Can I bother you for a minute of your time? All right. Can I tell you a little about what we're doing here? Sure. Less than a minute, I promise. Uh, we're trying to raise money to build an expansion to the Quincy Harris Memorial Hall, a shelter for homeless veterans and their families. Can you help? A donation of twenty dollars would put us well on our way. Twenty dollars ain't no chicken feed, but sure, I can help you out. That's very kind. What is your name, sir? Arthur Morgan. Your donation will be acknowledged on a founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. Well, good luck to you. Seems a worthwhile cause. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Thank you. What's new? A las causas nobles siempre hay que hacer. There you are. You boys ready? Of course. What else do you know about this guy? Not much, just he's some slick little greasy haired European clearly got power and money. Now, listen. If we go in there. Start shooting up the place. Boy's gonna get shot, that I guarantee. Better like this, you're gonna have a lot of protection. Hey, no one's gonna get shot, Arthur, so everyone just relax. We'll charm them. Trust me. This is the place? <coughs> Must be. You okay, John? I guess. Excuse me, sir. We have an appointment to see Mr. Bronte. Who are you? You get your boss down here and now so we can talk about this like gentlemen. Run along now, boy. Mm. Was that the special Dutch charm I heard so much about? Relax. You looking for a brother? I got this. Ok, bueno. Don't worry, boys. We come in peace. We just need to straighten a couple of things out with your boss. Sono sti buffoni. Sono qui per picciotto. Coi soldi? Why do you take his son? Excuse me. I said, why did you take his son? We ain't got no problems with you, sir. Nor you with us. But if you want to start one, there's going to be a lot of folks dead in this room before it's done. So, you walk into my city, sí. stinking of shit and looking like this, sí. and you come into my house before you have a bath, and you tell me how to act? Sí. You ask me to show compassion. Have I not shown you almost infinite compassion already by simply allowing you to breathe in my presence? No. Indeed you have. Now. We are simple country folk. All we have is each other. And you have gone and you have took his son over some dispute with some inbred ex-slavers. It ain't got nothing to do with any one of us. 
Jesus. You had nothing to do with destroying the liquor business. We was innocent bystanders. And that which we weren't innocent of, well, we... <laughs>